Hi, I'm Alex Grieve, better known as Ivy Crazy. In this video, I want to show you how a 13 inch section of 12 gauge wire can get 75% longer range out of the 433 diamond. Behind me is my vector network analyzer set up in vector voltmeter mode. You can see that I have two diamond antennas communicating with each other. The one over here is transmitting and this one is receiving. And you'll notice as my hand moves around, the numbers are jumping quite a bit. And that's because 433 has got a very long wavelength and it's very hard to get an accurate measurement. But watch what happens when I attach this wire three inches behind the diamond. Okay, we have a gain increase of five and a half dB. Six dB is double range. So what that means is that this system is capable of almost twice the range of what a standard diamond already gets you. While this might seem like magic, it's really just very refined physics in action. The wire I placed behind that diamond antenna is known as a parasitic radiator. This is how the Yagi antenna works. In fact, that's what this is. This is a two element Yagi. Now granted, there are other instances of the parasitic radiators, such as the case of the Minion and the Ion antennas. They use a similar technology to this one. But there's no such thing as a free lunch when it comes to RF. That gain comes at a price. And the reason it does is because that wire is working in conjunction with the diamond antenna to drive the signal that normally would be coming towards the back of the antenna forward. And therefore it is now directional and no longer omnidirectional. So watch what happens when I turn that antenna. Now note, as I turn the antenna, the signal strength begins to drop and drop and drop more as the antenna is rotated. And if I'm looking at the back of the antenna, you'll notice it's very weak. So as you remember, zero dB was where the diamond was without this radiator. So if I'm turning this and I get it to the zero dB point, it's right there. So that is about 45 degrees off of center. So if you stay within 45 degrees to the right or to the left, this is going to greatly increase your range. So your beam width is effectively 90 degrees. However, if you are to the side of the antenna, such as here, you'll notice we are 5 dB below where the diamond was without the radiator. That's because this radiator isn't just blocking the signal that's coming this way. It's actually working in unison with the diamond element to drive the signal forward, but it's also taking some of the signal that's coming out to the sides and driving it forward where you need it. So this is no longer an Omni, but a directional antenna. But if you're looking for a quick and easy range boost, go ahead and make yourself a simple two element Yagi. I might be crazy, and as always, keep them flying.